guys it's kang and welcome back to my channel i just wanted to hop on here and say what's up thank you for clicking on today's video and just wanted to chat a little honestly because i've missed chatting with you guys today's video is just over the creation museum and i just wanted to sit down and chat a little too about the joys i have in being able to do things like this with my family and i think i've just been in so much joy and awe of how much the Lord has provided for me in this area of growth because you guys know if you've been around motherhood and my journey to motherhood was a very difficult one and it was not something that I ever dreamt of doing. I was one of those where I really never wanted to be a stay-at-home mom and never really had a desire to have children early on in life and yet God being who he is and being so gracious has led me to this place of where this is nothing that I have ever planned for in my entire life yet it has been one of the hugest blessings and so as I'm editing this creation museum vlog I am just overwhelmed with awe and gratitude of what the Lord is doing in my life and has been doing in that I am now at a place in motherhood where I find joy in my children and I find joy in teaching them and loving them and being okay with not doing anything else but being their mother in the moment and I think I really needed for me and my heart to be humbled in this area because I was so caught up in the worldly pleasures of working high paying corporate jobs and living in New York City and things like that that at the end of the day yes it brings like pleasure but only momentarily and there is really no eternal fruit that comes from that and it will not satisfy me forever yet motherhood and me being in this way dying to myself in my personal struggles of not wanting to be a mother like God so graciously provided me with three beautiful children um, that I get to call my children and I'm so humbled as uh, just looking at how God created all of us and how he knows exactly how to change our hearts and where we fall short and he knows how to fill it up with his joy and his peace and I'm able to experience this joy today because of what jesus has done in my heart over all of these years of motherhood that i slowly had to die to my selfish ways of who i really am and i was one of those moms whenever i first had edith i was ashamed to just be a stay-at-home mom i was ashamed uh that if i filled out paperwork yeah uh, it's like what do i do i'm like i don't know i'm just a stay-at-home mom and yet today like i am so happy that the lord has done so much work in my life because i see my children and i just look at the young mom that i was and i can't believe i cannot believe guys that i thought i was just a stay-at-home mom like it breaks my heart to say that i just really felt like um the lord was prompting me to share this with you guys if you're in a season of struggling with motherhood know that you're not alone in that like i have been there and yet god has been so gracious to provide me with uh new eyes to see a new perspective to see that my life is full of joy and children are a blessing and there is nothing worth more than you know doing what the lord has called me to do and that is to raise my children in this season uh, regardless of what anybody else says and I'm saying this just from my personal experience not saying that this is what every mom needs to do but just the realization that what I needed to die to was those things and God humbled me in this way for those things and some other moms may not struggle with that and that's okay like god works in us in different ways and i just wanted to share a little of my heart with you i'm just so filled with uh just gratitude that i was able to go to the creation museum and do school in a way that i never thought i would do school you know because i grew up in public school and so did peter and um we never really dreamt of anything other than putting our kids through regular school like we did whenever we grew up and yet as I grew in my motherhood, I saw the Lord place on my heart 
to homeschool and it was definitely a challenge at first but I would not do it any other way right now like in this season I love it our children thrive in it and we get to do things like this where we get to go on trips during weird times of the year and get to go learn about things and it is just so fun and I'm so thankful that the Lord has blessed us with the capabilities to do that if you are struggling in this season of finding joy in motherhood uh, God's going to give you that joy and he will provide it in his own timing, in his own way, and he's uh, sanctifying you through motherhood in those ways. I hope that you guys enjoyed today's uh, Creation Museum vlog. It is super fun, so beautiful. I hope that you guys get to go see it one day. It is about a, like a 30 minute drive from the Ark Encounter, so make sure you plan a few days for both of those because, oh my, there's just so much to see, so much to do, and it's just so beautiful what they have created there if you've listened to me this far thank you and i will see you guys in my next one hi guys hi. yay say hi um, hi there we get some cutie pie i got a turtle a turtle and two turtles i got palkia yeah Pol a dinosaur that you named palkia yeah. Hey guys, so today we are actually heading to the Creation Museum and it will be very fun in Kentucky. Yesterday, uh, we took you guys along with us to the Ark Encounter and we hope that was fun for you guys to watch. We are with my mom, obviously, and Peter's parents and our whole family. So it has been really, really fun. I hope that you guys will enjoy our <laughs> fun vlog. Yes, lots of hand sanitizer. And hi Joe, let's put that straw up please. Put the straw up in your cup. Yes, mommy. Thank you. We'll catch you later. Bye. Yes, I like the <laughs> Yeah. See how big those things are, right? But the 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 leaves are so good. Wow, Edith. This is such a pretty trail. You do? I think it's pretty. Well, it's pretty. Well, it is pretty. Hi, Eli. Eli, it's okay. <laughs> Oh, I like this. <laughs> Guess he must like the bamboos. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>
It's okay. You got don't throw it. You got to yeah, just open hold your it hand. real steady, just like you know how. Oh, do this yeah. one. Do that one, baby. I don't want to do it. Are they a little intimidating? They're a little aggressive. Uh oh, oh, that rolled right oh. off. <laughs> I didn't hold. It. I hold it. I didn't hold it. Sorry, right. guys. You're a little aggressive. Bye. All done. We are right to here because that's the playground, and we cross right here. Hi. I wrote the zip line. 